Okay, this is uh, an abstract or surreal landscape painting. Landscape painting by Diego Rivera. And uh, we know Diego Rivera was. Uh, you can see that painting with uh, Carlo. So he was a great Mexican artist and throughout his life he was trying to build up the image of Mexico through art and uh, obviously he did have, to have the ability and uh, the capacity to express himself in this glorious form of art and you can see his skill the, the expression is just uh, it's so real and uh, surreal it's uh, he did have a great skill in expressing his art idea, right? So this one was a realist, uh, an, an abstract landscape, and it is surely an abstract landscape because it was uh, not a real landscape. And uh, in the middle of the painting was a piece of uh, tree wood. And he made this tree wood look like a, a human body, like a, a woman's body. And uh, the gray mountain was uh, like uh, mountains. And if you notice, there was something interesting which we could not understand and this was not explained some part was not explained this globe and light was explained but you can see that branch it's in such a strange shape it's like a heart or blood tube and uh, so for everyone this was, this was a surreal abstract painting but for his daughter one time he saw this exhibition and he said I knew this painting there was a story behind it so the story behind it was that uh, during the painting of uh, during the time of this painting there was one thing happened in the Me Mexican mine field, coal mine, and uh, for digging from the earth, so it abstract, uh, so it absolutely brings up the background. Could be a mine field, and uh, there was one woman mysteriously died or murdered so the daughter said this must be a tribute or at least triggered by that uh, particular history particular story and you can see through the knife and the glove there was something that uh, that was bubbling and burning in the artist's heart. We did not know what he would like to say, but this painting remains and will forever bring us attention and brings us a story to sing
and uh, to reflect. such a beautiful beautiful human shape and it's a beauty of uh, of true human and uh, of uh, a burning and the grilling and uh, and an emotion behind it. The smooth shape of the body and the rough shape, aggressive rough shape of the rocks. You feel shocked, you feel lonely, and when you hear your story, you want to tribute to human life. Whatever background it is, you want to re respect human life. Here is another piece of painting by Diego Rivera and uh, it's called Flower Care. And this painting is uh, it's just a, a beautiful contrast of color and uh, a very soft, smooth shape. Comparing this one, which is so tender and uh, so soft and so harmonious, full of love, with this one, which is full of passion, contrast, tension, and uh, and uh, bubbling hot, burning blood. Comparing with these two, you can see um, you you have different uh, different feeling. When you see this, you calm down and you appreciate. Diego Rivera was one of uh, the greatest artists in history a Mexican artist and he was world known but uh, he made sure he was more connected and he was very proud of being Mexican and uh, his painting subjects and, uh, reflects often times, many often times his focus is on the people, the peasants, the citizens, the workers, and the normal, ordinary people of Mexico. And uh, this one, you see the painting, the background dark, and bring up the beautiful flower, and bring up the white, the person in white, uh, white outfit and uh, kneel down to carry this whole bunch, whole basket of flour. And intentionally, he didn't paint the face of the workers. Let's take a closer look. So the face of the work was not painted. 
clearly and uh, if you see everything is so mellow so soft so tender and uh, the focus what I see here is the beautiful pink lavender color flower and this person kneel down he wants to pay respect he wanted to pay respect to the people through the things they are doing through their dedication to this beautiful flower through their action kneeling down and uh, paying respect to this beautiful life it's uh, a poetry of life